So I'm still in yesterday's clothes and I should probably start studying for neurology, but I think it's a good time to go to the gym and do some tricks. So I had time to do one trick and then a private class came in. So now we're gonna switch gyms. As you guys might have seen, I landed really short on my ankle. I was trying so hard to get that kick out. Totally wasn't worth it. I'm gonna feel this for a few days, but I guess it's just time to go home and study for neuro. How's it going everyone? Happy Monday. I just got to campus. I'm gonna try to find a little study room, do some studying. Today needs to be really productive. I wanna get through all of tomorrow's lectures and Friday's lectures. I got through all of yesterday or today's lectures yesterday. Uh, so that's good, but hopefully I can be productive. I've got lunch, so I'm planning on being here all day. My ankle is absolutely killing me, by the way. I'm on like 400 milligrams of ibuprofen right now, and I have a bottle in case I need more, but it was a little bit swollen this morning. I iced it a little bit yesterday, but it is absolutely killing me. I feel like the brain, it's so cool because like there's so much in it, like it's such a small space, mm -hmm. but that's also what makes it so hard because like I can already tell like on dissection, for example, it'd be so hard to recognize so much of this mm -hmm. without all the, the nice colors. I kind of, I'm so used to making like my own. Decided to call it early. I was starting to get really, really tired. I did, was not as productive as I wanted to be. I ended up going to a two hour meeting for a club called MedSpeak, where we basically work on presentations that we'll hopefully be able to give in the community one day. And then I joined another club, which I'm the director of recruitment and outreach for now, all of a sudden, surprise. So that was really cool. So basically a lot of club stuff. I did get through all of tomorrow's lectures and all the Anki cards for them, which um, a second year student, made an Anki deck for uh, our neuroanatomy. And so our entire class is pretty much just like using that deck because apparently that's all we really need to focus on. But the plan for the rest of the night is to pretty much just relax. I'm honestly really tired. I feel very sluggish, probably because of the vacation. Uh, but I got through all of tomorrow's lectures. And so for my goal for tomorrow is to get through all of Friday's lectures. And then I'll basically have Wednesday, Thursday, Friday to just go back through all of it, um, really keep up with the Anki cards. Again, this first exam is mainly neuroanatomy. And from what everyone's saying, it's like, just focus on the lectures, uh, do the Anki cards that the second year student made, um, because it's pretty much just like a big anatomy exam. But yeah, I'm gonna go home, put some ice on this ankle. It was kind of bothering me a lot today, especially just now while I was walking down the steps. So hopefully it feels better later in the week. Good morning, guys. I have a lot of Anki cards to do. I have all of my review cards from over the last few months, but I also have all the anatomy ones that I did yesterday, which took me forever, honestly, while I was doing them. But I think that's like the most important thing to be doing for this exam is just like the Anki cards, getting the anatomy in my head, uh, cause that's what the exam is mostly gonna be. My goal is to get as much of it done as I can before PBL. And then after PBL, I'll probably just stay on campus and probably try to get through all of Friday's material. But for now, I'm gonna go get some caffeine. Anki's going pretty good today. My pace is pretty good. I'm about to start my last anatomy deck. I have four cards to finish in this one, but I got to tune into the Apple van. I'm really excited to see if they release the new iPhone. This new neural engine is capable of an astounding 11 trillion operations per second. I don't need it. I don't need it. I don't need it, but I kind of want it. Look at these super cool socks I got while I was in Kentucky. Absolutely love them. All right, I just got to campus. Today is our first day with our new PBL groups. Should be a lot of fun. I think the doctor is gonna be really cool. Uh, so I'm excited to get to know them all. Obligatory video of me walking up these stairs. PBL is done, time to get back to the Anki cards. All right, I am leaving campus right now. I was not nearly as productive as I wanted to be. Uh, I was kind of going through Friday's material, but I just couldn't really get myself to focus too much. So I'm just gonna go home and relax and just play games for the night. I'm not really too pressed about it because again, I was trying to do Friday's material. So it's only Tuesday. 
So I'm pretty ahead. So I think I'm just gonna take the rest of the night to just relax and then pick it back up tomorrow. Oh, and I forgot to mention, I had my new PBL group today. They're all really cool. Some of them I've met before, some of them I've met, but just haven't really had the chance to get to know. And so I think it's gonna be a really fun eight weeks. The doctor is really cool, really nice. And so, yeah, I think it's gonna be a great time. Good morning, guys. So I just woke up, I'm super tired, and I did not wake up with enough time to start my Anki cars for the day, which kind of sucks, because I have like 600 of them. Right now, my PBL group and I have to work on an assignment. And then at 10, we have a two hour uh, class. And then at one, I have a meeting to discuss a previous block and like recommendations and uh, things kind of we would change uh, in the curriculum. And so kind of a lot of stuff to do. And then I also have to do my PBL presentation today, uh, which is gonna be on like headaches and stuff. And then I also need to fit in studying. So kind of a long day. Uh, hopefully I can get everything done. All right, I finished my class a little while ago. We pretty much just talked to the professors and then we got broken out into our small groups for our community projects. And that was pretty cool. It was good to talk to them and kind of do some planning. I even got to call the director of the Boys and Girls Club that we're gonna be working with and set up a Zoom meeting. So we're gonna do that next week. And I think we're gonna meet Friday to kind of go look at the area. But now I have to go to a meeting for uh, the feedback for one of the previous blocks that we just had. And so a lot of stuff, all I wanna do is start studying new anatomy but I still have to finish my Anki cards and then do these meetings. I have to do my presentation and there's just so much you have to do, but it's okay. I'm still technically ahead on anatomy, so it's really not that big of a deal. But you know, when you want to study and other things come up, get a little bit cranky, but it's okay. It'll be fine. Okay, so I have a meeting and I'm honestly so exhausted right now. I had my group thing this morning and then another group thing and then I had this meeting and I had to do Anki in between as best as I could. And then I still have like 200 Anki cards left to do, which is like crazy because it's so late in the day. And tonight I still have to do my PBL presentation. I have to uh, review some uh, derm physical exam stuff because we have a standardized patient tomorrow and doctoring. So I have to review all the things we would you know, do in a physical exam because I might have to give the physical exam. And so I have to do that tonight to fish my Anki cards. And I still want to start new lectures for neuroanatomy because I haven't you know, done any today and I kind of barely did any yesterday. So, still so much to do today, but I'm gonna get some food right now, get a good Jersey Mike sub, rejuvenate myself, and then I'll get started. So I had finished my presentation and I've only gone through one anatomy lecture because I am just struggling through the cranial nerves. Like, it's so much stuff. I know that Anki's perfect for this, but when you're first going through the Anki cards, it literally takes forever because I press again on like almost every single card. I still want to get through at least one more anatomy lecture tonight and I have to review derm for the standardized patient tomorrow so I don't think I'm going to bed anytime soon. All right I am definitely calling it a night. I'm exhausted. I managed to finish all the anatomy lectures I wanted to get through and crawl my way through the Anki cards. I'm definitely taking the approach of just like struggling with memorizing the anatomy and then over the weekend I'll go back and really focus on the relationships of the structures, the physiology a little bit more. But right now I just want to make sure everything is like familiar when it comes to terminology because there's so many like big names and so many like little structures and there's just a lot of it. And so that's the focus for now. And then I spent like the last half hour going through the derm notes from like two weeks ago in our doctoring class uh, because we have a standardized patient tomorrow. So I need to know how to give a derm exam in case I'm the person who has to do it. And so that's gonna be a lot of fun. I might volunteer, kind of depends on, uh, you know, if they do volunteers or if they just choose one of us to do it, uh, but we'll see. But anyway, for now, I'm gonna go to bed. I'll see you guys tomorrow. Good morning, guys. I'm about to hop into my foundations of clinical practice class and we're gonna go see our standardized patient. It should be a lot of fun. All right, we just finished up with our simulated patient and it honestly went really, really well. My group of six got split into two groups of three and uh, each group had one person who did the past medical history, one person who did the physical exam, and the third person who did the entire review of the case uh, to our attending. And so I got to do the entire review of the case, which was good for me because at one point I was a scribe, so it was easy to like keep up with the typing uh, because you guys will find out that it's really hard to take good notes while you're doing the interview. Uh, so that's something I definitely will have to work on in the future, but today my job was to do the entire case presentation, which I think went really well. And what's good about the fact that I did the case presentation is that we have to do a note by Sunday at noon, and uh, by doing the presentation, I have a really good idea of what should be in the note and a good organization. I just have to format it in a little better way to submit it. But it was super cool. Our patient had shingles, uh, melanoma, and a uh, just a seborrheic keratosis, which is uh, super benign. Um, really common in older individuals. For right now, I should be starting on the note, but I think I'm gonna get a head start on Anki since I haven't done any today and I have a ton of cards since I've been doing a lot of new cards this week. So I'm gonna go do that and I'll catch up with you guys in a little bit. Stop it. <laughs> no. I 
ended up taking a nap because I was just so tired, but now I have to go to PBL. All right, I am heading home right now. I stayed after PBL to do some studying and I had a meeting to attend and I got some stuff done. I was basically just watching Ninja Nerd on subjects I had reviewed in Anatomy this week uh, because I think I'm just gonna slow my roll a little bit, get more understanding of the physiology, some of the spinal pathways, the nerve pathways, and then I'll move on to new material. I'm still ahead, which is why I'm kind of like not super stressed at all. Um, but now I'm gonna go get some food, relax, play some video games for the rest of the night. I have two meetings tomorrow. One of them is to talk about research. So that'll be pretty exciting. Best part about Fridays is just laying in bed. Even though I really should start doing my Anki cards. I just really want to lounge this morning and just relax a bit, but I have so many cards to do. I should probably get started. All right, in an hour I have a research meeting, which is kind of surprising. I didn't think we were already gonna to have to talk about research. I thought we started that after our first year, but I guess we have a meeting on that today. But right now I'm gonna go get some Starbucks, treat myself a little bit, and then I'll get into the meeting. All right, we just got done with our research meeting. It was super informative. Basically, we're not really starting research until like the end of May of next year, but they just wanted us to start thinking about it, you know, get it on our radar that we will eventually have to go into our research block. And so we need to start thinking about what we might want to do, maybe some of the specialties. They gave us some of the research mentors and specialties that they have connections with. So we can ask some of the upperclassmen what their experience has been like. I've never really been too much of a research guy, honestly. I've done a little bit in undergrad, but I never really saw myself as doing it as a clinician. Uh, but we'll see. It kind of depends on how my experience in medical school is. I still have a lot to do this weekend. I want to go over more of the neuroanatomy material. I want to go back over everything I've already been going over. And I just remembered I still have to do my note for the standardized patient we saw yesterday, which I knew I should have just done after the class, but I didn't. And now I'm dealing with the consequences of my actions. Unfortunately, I probably won't do any tricking this weekend. My ankle's still kind of bothering me. Uh, not so much now when I walk on it, but in certain positions, uh, like inversion and whatnot, it definitely hurts. Also, I want to start editing this vlog tonight, so I think I'm going to call it here. I know it was kind of a slow week. I basically did Anki, and that was pretty much it all week, which I know usually I'm doing like boards and patho and everything, but the M2s made this deck for us because this is an in-house exam, and they said basically everything we need to know is in these Anki cards because it's just a pure anatomy exam, and that's going to be my primary method of studying, but I'm going to fill in the gaps with other resources. I've been doing Ninja Nerd. I'm going to start boards this weekend, and so I'll definitely update you guys on next week's vlog about my progress on Neuro. But anyways, thank you guys so much for joining me this week. I really appreciate it. Make sure to like, comment, subscribe, and I will see you guys next week.